Okay, so today we're gonna um, load a clean flight, clean flight, uh, which is a base flight derivative on a CC3D. So first of all, why would we want to do that? Uh, I, I don't know because we can, um, you know. But I sort of look at uh, clean flight and and base flight, but particularly clean flight is more of a acro type. Uh, um, Firmware for your for your board. It's it um, you know on 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 uh, nase boards. It really is stable and it and gives you a good you know acro type flyer. Would prefer that. Now if I look at CC3D, it has great features for the, the cruiser type guy. I would say and of course you can fly it acro. But if you're flying and uh, you know um, with with its axis hold or its or its, or its hold. That kind of stuff is great in CC3D or it's cruise control. As you go into a, a turn, it will automatically give throttle to lift you know you you up and but you know those things aren't in clean flight. But clean flight has some other value uh, uh, value in terms of its stability, its how quick it reacts. You know, so it's you know it's cool uh, um, uh, and and here's really how you do it. So if you have a standard CC3D board, you know the first thing. You'll you'll do is um, you know you'll you'll start it up and you'll go into firmware over here. I'm running a bit of an older firmware on this board, still the 14.1. But um, you you you'll load your firmware there, and, and the, the easiest way to do this is you'll click Alt, right? You'll see the steps go, and then um, this um, this new menu will appear over here, and over here there's uh, um, a few options. So you'll just click Open. And you're gonna load a uh, um, a firmware. Okay, you're gonna need a file from this site, uh, GitHub. I'll put the link in the description. And um, this is where the downloads are. And at the moment, and you're gonna look for this file, cleanflight underscore cc3d dot bin, not the hex file, the bin file. You're gonna download that file. Click and download it. And then um, over here you're going to hit open and you're going to look for your and you're going to take that file and you're going to now it says hey there's a warning do you know what you're doing and I click this and you're going to hit flash. I'm not going to do it on this specific board. This will run all the way through to 100%. The board will restart and then it will no longer be able you will no longer be able to interact with it with um, with uh, um, open pilot GCS um, it is then a, uh, a, a CC3D board uh, uh, a flash with clean flight and to interact with it you need the clean flight application and that is something typically you install on uh, um, on your machine there's base flight and there's also a clean flight version you can download and if you go to their website, you actually um, can get that. And I'll put the the the, um, the uh, link to it. But uh, here's the GUI download, and um, it's a Chrome application like all the others. And when you launch it, um, if your drivers are installed, same as Base Five drivers and everything's installed, you'll recognize it here, and you'll actually be able to go into Clean Flight. And uh, use your board. So it's as simple as that to really update your board from a, uh, a CC3D to a, uh, a clean flight. Now, once it's inside clean flight, there's a few nuances I found. First of all, um, the board uh, you cannot run it on PWM. I can only make it work on PPM. Um, there's always the your channel seems to be missing and it doesn't work. So you have to do it via PPM. So I had to put a little PWM to PPM converter in, and the second uh, thing I found is the um, the, the um, uh, failsafe does not work at all. It it gives all sorts of issues, so it doesn't work. But um, uh, and maybe it's just me. I I don't might, might not understand it. But you know, once it's uh, flashed, and um, I dumbed down the defaults a little bit. I use PID controller one. It has five controllers or five pieces of code you can execute to, uh, you know, uh, fly 
and, and control your copter. I did PID controller one and once I did that and dumbed down a little bit of a values because my little copter is a small hobby king with plastic motors <laughs> and uh, but here's the flight video and, and, and it actually flew amazing I, I uh, you know even compared to the CC3D standard the, the base flight really uh, uh, the clean flight really really flew tremendous so uh, let's have a look at that Oh man, this is not LRS. <laughs> this is a fly sky. Real cheap, so doesn't make it that far. <laughs> 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 